Hey guys, so I did want to give you guys an update. I went to my PCM today and I discussed um, what happened in the ER, the reason why I went to the ER. Um, you guys might not, well, you guys, some of you might not know, but I did have a stroke two years ago. So that is always a big concern of mine um, with going through this procedure. Um, if you have underlying conditions and stuff, please discuss that with your doctor. Don't um, try to hide it and stuff because it won't be good. It's not, I mean, it's not beneficial. So I did discuss that. And as I was discussing that, she was like, right now, she was like, oh, she was like, and I'm, I rather say that to her, but because of course she doesn't know. So I do want to discuss that and address that. And so that is what I'm doing. <laughs> So that is what I am doing. I'm not gonna hide it because uh, hide and then pretend like, oh, it didn't happen. Yeah, it was two years ago. And even after that, I had a C-section, which is a major surgery. <laughs> Adrian, come on now. So it is, a, it is, um, I lost my train. But my thing is, um, yeah, I want a flat stomach. Mm. I do I want and I have it scheduled but if it has to be postponed and even if it doesn't happen I rather it not happen and something happens to me because I have to be here for these four beautiful kids and one awesome husband so I do have to be here and I want to be here I, I don't care I'd rather have walk around with you know a flab and stuff i rather walk around with that than not be here at all because oh i wanted this elective surgery so i do have to get um i have to go to a hemologist a blood doctor and i do have to go to a cardiologist I have to be cleared by those two i do have to get um, get that stuff checked and it's fine. it's fine. So I say all that to say um, When you're getting elective surgery, please be open and honest with your doctor and Just be open and honest with yourself because I mean I could have went in there even when I went in there She was like, oh, you're gonna be an easy patient the nurse She was like, oh, you're gonna be an easy patient and then she left out and I talked to the doctor and then she came back She was like, oh you're going to be difficult. No, she didn't say that, but she just was like, oh, you're not going to be an easy patient. And I'm not. And so I want to be cleared by my doctor and be open and honest. And you should do that too. Like, don't just go into stuff and be like, oh, this happened all these years ago. I'm fine. Da, 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 da. No. Like, speak up and talk, like, address everything, especially things that are of concern. And yeah. So, uh, it's looking like I might yeah, enjoy your night. I just wanted to give you guys a follow up, and yeah, those um, those EKG bandages they put on me—they still itch like crazy, but it's healing up. So.